Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Jeffasaurus Lego video. Today I'm going to be giving you my opinion on the new HUD, uh, new HUD mold. Sorry about that kind of view up there. There have been some controversial changes in the Lego Star Wars over the past years that's been around. We've had the stunt, we've had the stud shooter guns, which I'm still not really a fan of. We've had the Darth Vader helmet, which I am a huge fan of. And now we have the new hood mold, which I'll give you my opinion on in a minute. So, recently I bought a Lego Death Star laser cannon thing. Oh, oh hold on. I'll just... I'm going to show you it at a sky view, you can kind of see outside of my backdrop and whatnot. But yeah, this came with a Death Star Trooper, but I don't know where he is at the moment. So I'll have to locate him, but for the time being, I'll just show you. Oh, oh, sorry, hold on, I'm having some technical difficulties. Yeah, these backgrounds, I need to figure out how to prop them up better. Anyhow, after that, we'll goof up. So, in that set, you got a Death Star Trooper, and you got old Ben Kenobi here, who has a new hood mold. And I got the set because I needed another blue lightsaber, because I'd run out of them, lost one. And I needed a brown cape, because I didn't know any of those. It's a big bonus for me, but also I saw this, this hood mold right here. Now, if you're new to Lego Star Wars, or you're just not entirely familiar with hoods and whatnot, this may not look too weird to you, but if you really know much about Lego Star Wars molds and whatnot, you're going to notice some big differences. Sorry, I just noticed how close the camera that was. This is what... The hood mold that we've used since like 2003 looks like. Like this hood mold has been around since the beginning of Lego Star Wars. And actually, no, I guess it is more like 1999. Yeah, this hood mold is 21 years old, and they just decided to replace it. So a few key differences here is first of all, this hood is much more wrinkled, which gives it. A more realistic appearance in comparison to this one, which is just slightly inclined in different areas, much less wrinkled. Also, you will notice this has a chin strap. Sorry, sorry, I'm looking at pieces, not a camera. This has a chin strap right here, but this is a chin strap. Also, this hood is pointed back more, as you can see. No. No real back point there. This one is slightly taller when you put it on minifigure, etc, etc. Minor details, but yeah. So, I'm not sure what the whole LEGO community reaction is to this. But in my opinion, it's really just how you look at it. From what angle you look at it. Or I guess you could say, from a certain point of view. It's focusing there, yeah, from a certain point of view. So, this looks slightly different on camera than it does in person. I recommend you go buy, buy a set with this for yourself. They did some other A New Hope sets with old Ben in them. They re released the Final Duel 2 set that comes with Vader, Luke, the Emperor, Royal Guards. The death shaft, whatever. And, um, or not really death shaft. Screw you, Rise of Skywalker. But so, what are my thoughts on this new hood mold? Well, at first, I thought it was disgusting. A complete waste of Lego funding, and we should really go back to the old hoods. But now that I'm looking at it more aesthetically, it looks a lot better. It, it, it really looks better than the other hood. You never noticed there was anything wrong with the old hood 
until you look at it after looking at the new hood mold on someone, and then you're like, yeah, this, this doesn't, this doesn't look nearly as good. So, in conclusion, I think that the new hood mold, it's really a point of view thing. I personally think it's good. I know some people probably still aren't over it, but it's not stun gun. It's not stud good. Bad. I, I can't say the word stud gun. Yeah. It's not, it's not that bad. Well, I hope you did enjoy my desperate grasp at content today. If you did, I would love it if you were to like and subscribe. If you've done so already, I thank you. Join my Discord server. It's in some other video links, but for reasons I don't have time to explain, it won't be in this one, probably. Well, I'll see you next time. Stay safe. Wear your seatbelts.